Hey Internet, it's Colorful Artie, and welcome back to Spy Fox in Dry Cereal. So, before we move on, I have to actually... Pfft, that was great. Uh, we actually have to backtrack for a bit, because there are several things I forgot about. So, first off, I forget what the key we're looking for is even shaped like, so we're gonna have to reuse the x-ray gum. Here. Oh, Mr. Utterly, guess what I need to do again. Okay, okay, but do me a favor. Could you get me a pillow? The fanning is rough on the flank stage. <laughs> It looks like I need to find that key. Alright. That was weird. I don't know why it booted me out of my window for no reason. Whatever. That's what the key looks like. Cool. Also, we didn't really examine this office at all last time. The Cheese Award. The Apple Award. The Orange You Glad I Didn't Say It Award. The Pig Race Award. Any of you guys blow my house down? <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> hey, it's Monkey Penny. Hey, dude. Grande Fromaggio. All oh, right. Italian for the big cheese. How droll. <laughs> hey, it looks like that says Grim Fandango if you uh, just glance at it. Oh, we don't get to see the names of all of- Oh man. I thought we could look at these, like, paintings and actually see what they're called. Darn it. Well, they all have ironic names, so, like, one of them is Whistler's Goat, one of them is, like, the Blue Goat, American Gothic, uh, Cloved Goat going up a staircase. Yeah, they're pretty interesting. All right, we also have to remember that pattern. Right, right, left, down, up. Usually. This looks exactly like that diagram over in the locker room. Now I need to move these levers to the positions shown in the diagram. Bam. Now we can go up. Now we get in this little trolley car. This must be some sort of tram to take people around in Kid's Fortress. So that's the Milky Weapon of Destruction. Hot butter. There's Kid's giant milk carton. <laughs> so we can go around. We got goat milk. It looks like uh -huh. a billboard. That's a very funny pun. Then we've got just kind of a whole lot of nothing over here. And this door. We need to go in here. Is Bigfoot living in there? Or just Donkey Kong? I always get them confused. Those guards are in ready position. I wonder what they're guarding. Well, I mean, that gorilla's staring right at you, Spy Fox, so, I mean, they can already see Those you. Those guards are in ready position. I wonder what they're guarding. Uh, so, let's just walk by. I don't think anyone will care. Hey! Where do you think you're going? Oh, hi. I'm from the accounting office. I was asked to count all the offices. I need to get into that room and make sure it's really an office. If you're from the accounting office, you know perfectly well that this is William the Kid's office. No one but the Grand Goathead himself is allowed in there. Oh, right. Of course. How silly of me. That's the office that really counts. Sorry to bother you. <laughs> wow. I need to get into Kid's office and take a look around. So, for now, you might be wondering how can we get past these guards? Well, we've got a spy gadget just for this Here's situation. Where I my spy gadget. There's one sound the ear can hear better than any other. The sound of falling money. They should get a tickle from this nickel. No, 
know you want it. <laughs> Everyone wanted it. Sorry, folks. I'm on a mission. You must be one dedicated accountant! <laughs> I'm not an accountant, lady. Please, you've got to let us go. This is going to be a real blemish on our resume. Uh, as much as I hate mm. to blemish your resume, uh, I can give you some chicken knuckles. That's not going to do me any good. Uh, I, know, I know you guys probably feel bad that you didn't get some money, so I can give you some. That's not going All to right, do me fine, any spy good. folks. We won't give them free money. <laughs> Oh, this must be Kid's secret volcano office. I should take a look around. I love how I think only in the white water path, if you look out here, you'll see that there's water outside the door, and which is awesome. I think in the other path, which is not underwater, I don't think it does that. I think it's just like a blue mural. No, 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 I'm not coming out. Oh no, 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 I'm not coming out. Is there a genie living in this? Oh, okay. But if he looks, I'm gonna go away. <laughs> oh, he saw me. <laughs> wow, okay, I've never knew about that. Whoa! Spies! So here's something cool. You can draw a picture in Kid's office if you want. So, Wafflem drew my avatar when he played this, so it's only fair that I draw his avatar as well. Wafflem's another Let's Player. He played Spy Fox a few months ago for the first time. It was a very enjoyable series. How do the lemming... how are the lemmings arranged again? I forget if it was on like that diagonal or this diagonal. I think it's on this diagonal. So uh, they got the green hair. And they got the blue... the little blue bodies. I know that looks terrible, I'm sorry. I have to draw off a trackpad, and I'm not good at drawing to begin with. There you go, Wafflem! I hope you like it. And we can get a brand new sheet of paper if we want. So, huh, what to draw, what to draw... Hmm... Ooh, I know! Alright, this will be a bit tricky, I think, but... Oh man, if I, if I can pull this off, though, it'll be, like, the greatest drawing you could possibly leave. <gasps> Care to take a guess at what I'm drawing? <laughs> Not exactly how it's supposed to look. <laughs> but I think it'll turn out pretty good. Uh, this isn't turning out terribly great. <laughs> I had to try, though. <laughs> That's pretty good. 
detected by these dangerous lasers. Let's see. The red laser connects with the red socket, and the blue laser connects to the blue socket. I wonder if moving these mirrors will redirect the lasers. So this is a little mirror puzzle that you have to do. So, as you can see, we've got these lasers here, and they're overlapping with the key wallet. We need to get the key wallet, but we can't if there are lasers blocking the way. So what we need to do is basically redirect the blue laser. You can see it's moving this way. And the red laser, which is moving this way. Uh, basically, the rules, you can't have the red laser or the blue laser reflect right back from where it's coming from. So, for example, if we make this mirror right here, then the blue laser is just going to reflect right back into its socket, which is not allowed. If you put the mirror, like, per uh, parallel to the laser, then it'll just pass right through it. Whereas if you do one of these mirrors, it'll actually reflect in a given direction. If I do this, the blue laser is going to get reflected up into one of these red dispensers, and you can't do that. What? Actually, it's going to get reflected there. What we have to do is we need to reflect the blue laser into this blue one, and then the red laser into this red one. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to change this mirror, so it's that one. That blue laser is giving me the blues. If I can't get that red laser redirected, I might as well file for unemployment. So now that this laser is like that, if we can reflect the blue laser down, it'll pass right through that mirror and into that blue socket. The mirror to reflect it down is this one. As long as that red laser is still over the key, I won't be able to snatch it away. So now we need to basically do the same thing with the red laser. So we'll do like this. If I can't get that red laser redirected, I might as well file for unemployment. And then we'll swap it with this mirror. That did the trick. Now I can grab the key wallet. Not a very impressive trap, kid. I did it! I got the key! Now all I have to do is find that control panel to the Milky Weapon of Destruction. <laughs> nice backflip, Spy Fox. Oh, one last touch I want to put here. Those look like C's more than E's, but it's the best I can do. <laughs> so now Kid's gonna enter his office, see the key wallet's missing, and then, then just have the troll face on his, like, billboard. Oh, that is amazing. <laughs> oh, that, that amuses me way more than it should. I normally just draw an insulting picture of William the Kid on there. But, no, this is, this is good, too. <laughs> That was subtle, Spy Fox. Very subtle. This must be where William the Kid keeps his controls for the Milky Weapon of Destruction. I should let Monkey Penny know I've made it here. Spy Fox to Mobile Command Center. Please stand by. Spy Fox, good to hear from you. What's up? I'm in William the Kid's control room. The launching panel for the Milky Weapon of Destruction is right here. Great. Spy Fox out. Yep, so this is the control room where we can uh, deactivate the Milky Weapon of Destruction and essentially end the game. Kind of. Holy heifers! What kind of a ghastly villain would steal all of the world's milk? The goat kind, apparently. Yeah, what's the one the kid got against milk? Granted, I'm not a big fan of milk either, but I always see how it's necessary and I use it in like baking and stuff. That's right. Colorful already bakes, and he's proud of it. Now, which key should I use? So we need this key, which is a weird one. I hope this is the right key. Once again, I've saved the world from a horrible, or in this case, smelly, fate. Now I need to go get that goat. Not so fast, my crafty friend. You may think you have outfoxed me by disarming my milky weapon of destruction, but I'm afraid it's too late to save your precious cows. 
It's over, Billy. Give yourself up. Don't ever call me Billy. It's William. <laughs> and it's not over yet, my foxy nemesis. When I pull this lovely lever, the cow stables will become completely flooded with milk. And that will be the end of the dairy world as we know it. Oh no, the cows! That's the most despicable thing I've ever seen. <laughs> that is like the weirdest looking laugh ever. <laughs> Man, this is really rich. Kid, you're kidding yourself if you think I'm going to let you get away with this. It's too late. And now, if you'll excuse me, Mr. Fox, I have a flight to catch on my giant metallic getaway blimp where I will implement my plan to take over the world, filling it with my delicious goat byproducts. Delicious? You must be insane. Insane, you say? You're the crazy one, if you think you can save the cows. Adios, Mr. Fox. And good luck finding this secret passageway to the stables. You'll need it. <laughs> Ouch, that looks like it would hurt. Stupid door. Thanks for leaving a little <laughs> clue, kid. Now all I have to do is find that ascot. So kid got his ascot stuck in the door and it completely like unhinged one of the doors. That's some real quality construction work. And I can't I should have set a timer. I can't tell how far into the episode we are. You know what, I think I'll end the episode off here, because this seems like a good spot to do so. Thanks for watching, I'm Colorful Artie. I hope to see you next time, where we... Actually, I think we're going to finish up the game in the next episode. What do you know? Have a great day, and God bless.